Caitlin? If you ask me, you know, if I can read her, you know, and see if anything negative is going on, and I, I saw this part of her head. Well, I actually cracked my head open on the chest of drawers in my room with my mom. Like, I got up from the floor and I hit it. Oh. And you noticed, you were like, something happened to you here. And I'm like, how did you know? Because you can't really see the scar and nobody knows what happened to me. We turned on the spirit box. This uh, enables uh, spirits to be able to communicate. Caitlin hasn't given you permission to be inside of her. I heard you then. I heard Caitlin. This area has gotten darker. Florida. Florida. Are you a demon? Uh, As I said, my name with my voice. What do you want? I don't think you have any power over her anymore. You're clean. No, you are. There's nothing there. I was actually investigating the hanging tree in Fort Lauderdale. I asked people in the local, and she responded yes. And she knew anything about it. She was like, oh my god, I can't believe it. You know, the owner of the store had just told her maybe an hour or so beforehand about the tree and it's the first time he talked about it. I had asked him if he spoke about it the past week, month, year. He said no. He doesn't want people to know about it because it's bad for business. So she said he had just brought it up to her. Yeah. And then uh, it was kind of crazy because of what my store owner friend told me and then what he asked and it kind of just was like, you know, very, very odd.